Contrasting the consonants T and D. Listening. Listen to and repeat the pairs of words you hear. Number one. Tip. Dip. Two. Cart. Card. Three. Tight. Tide. Four. But. Bud. Five. Brett. Bread. Six. Fraught. Fraud. Seven. Train. Drain. Eight. Fat. Fad. Nine. Pat. Pad. Ten. Team. Deem. Listening discrimination. Dictation. You're going to hear some pairs of words. Some words have the T sound, others have the D sound. Without looking at the video, write down each pair of words onto a sheet of paper, then replay the video to see the correct answers. One. Eight. Ed. Two. Grade. Great. Three. Grabbed. Washed. Four. Qualities. Oddities. Five. Take. Take. Six. Deduce. Deduce. Seven. Add. At. Eight. Truce. Truce. Nine. Tighten. Dampen. Ten. Degree. Retreat. Voice recording exercise one. In this exercise, you will read some sentences aloud. It is suggested that you read the sentences silently for meaning. Then you will make a digital recording as you read the sentences aloud. Make sure that you speak directly into your microphone so that you can get a clear recording of your pronunciation. Pay particular attention to the T and D consonant sounds in each word. After you finish, compare your recording to a sample native speaker recording. Pause the video to make your recording. Now, listen to me read the five sentences. One. Actually, Earth's density is due in part to gravitational compression. If not for this, Mercury would be denser than Earth. 2. If we examine words other than hand, we find many additional instances where each of these three families is characterized by different looking roots, just as in the case of hand. 3. By the 1980s, the downbursts and microbursts were being studied as a unique phenomenon generated by things such as an intrusion of dry air. 
at long last we had a way to distinguish tornado damage from damage of non-tornadic winds. Four. Another sign of intelligence thought to be absent in most non-human animals is the ability to engage in complex meaningful communication. Only recently has the general perception of parrots as mindless mimics been shown to be incorrect. 5. Several tools have been developed to help land users identify unstable slopes, slope maps, geology maps, and landslide deposit maps are available for public inspection at the Santa Cruz County Planning Department. Voice Recording Exercise 2 In this exercise, you will read a paragraph aloud. It is suggested that you read the paragraph silently for meaning first, then you will make a digital recording as you read the paragraph aloud. Make sure you speak directly into your microphone so you can get a clear recording of your pronunciation. Pay particular attention to the T and D consonant sounds in each word. After you finish, compare your recording to a sample native speaker recording. Pause the video to make your recording now. Next, listen to a native speaker read the same paragraph and try to determine what words or sounds you're having difficulty pronouncing. The other method is stretching. The other method of stretching is ballistic, which involves bouncing in your stretch. This is very unadvisable for many reasons, including that you may injure yourself by damaging your muscle fibers. Also, biology provided your body with two protective mechanisms. One senses that a muscle is overstretched and sends you pain signals. The other is called the stretch reflex and is there to protect you from overstretching. By reflex action, it contracts the stretch muscle to make it a shock absorber and also halt the stretch before the muscle is injured. Because of the stretch reflex, the stretch muscle shortens, preventing you from reaching a fully stretched position. Continuing to stretch this way is detrimental in the long run, as your body will start to adapt against it, and you may find it difficult to stretch properly at all. Finally, listen to a voice recording during which you will read along with the speaker or me, you have successfully completed this exercise when you're able to read along with the speaker at the same pace without too many stumbles or stutters. All right, here we go. You ready? Three, two, one. The other method of stretching is ballistic, which involves bouncing in your stretch. This is very unadvisable for many reasons, including that you may injure yourself by damaging your muscle fibers. Also, Biology provided your body with two protective mechanisms. One sense is that a muscle is overstretched and sends you pain signals. The other is called the stretch reflex and is there to protect from overstretching. By reflex action, it contracts the stretch muscle to make it a shock absorber and also halt the stretch before the muscle is injured. Because of the stretch reflex, the stretch muscle shortens, preventing you from reaching a fully stretched position. Continuing to stretch this way is detrimental in the long run as your body will start to adapt against it and you may find it difficult to stretch properly at all. Articulation tip for the T sound. The T is an alveolar stop consonant. Make this sound without vibration of the vocal folds. For example, when you say Place your index and your middle finger on your throat. You should feel no vibration of the vocal folds when you produce this sound. More airflow than the D is pushed through the vocal tract when the T is produced. For example, 
take a small piece of paper, place it in front of your lips, and then say the word take. The air flow released from your mouth should cause the paper to flap as if a stiff breeze were blowing against it. Articulation tip for the D sound. Like the T, the D is an alveolar stop consonant. Make this sound with vibration of the vocal folds. For example, when you say D, place your index and your middle finger on your throat, you should feel vibration of the vocal folds when you produce this sound. Less airflow than the T is pushed to the vocal tract when the D is produced. For example, take a small piece of paper, place it in front of your lips, and then say the word done. The relatively minimal airflow released from your mouth should not cause the paper to move in any way.